हेलो फ्रेंड्स टुडे इन दिस ट्यूटोरियल आई विल बी टॉकिंग अबाउट ए अलर्ट मॉडल लाइब्रेरी इन जावा स्क्रिप्ट व्हिच इज कॉल्ड एज अलर्टिफाई जेएस एंड वी विल बी लुकिंग एट एग्जांपल ऑफ दिस लाइब्रेरी सो फर्स्ट ऑफ ऑल यू नीड टू गो टू दिस ऑफिशियल वेबसाइट व्हिच इज alertifyjs.com एंड यू कैन सी दिस इज द ऑफिशियल वेबसाइट ऑफ द दिस अलर्ट लाइब्रेरी आई हैव रिटन अ कंप्लीट डिटेल ब्लॉग पोस्ट इनसाइड my website codingsiksha.com the link will be there inside the video description you can just go to this blog and follow along with the video i have given all the examples which are there inside this success dialog is there confirm dialog is there so all this code snippets will be there inside the video description so go to this blog and copy all the source code and now first of all guys you can see this is the official website and you can even no, uh, use this inside note application as well you can install this as a node package manager you can see node dependency and if you just click on the examples tab here it will show you uh, all the examples which are there you can just click the run example button this is a full screen window alertify window you can see various themes also comes in which is the semantic ui bootstrap and they have also their license agreement window if you, if i run this window you will see you will get this beautiful uh, license agreement window where you can just deploy this on your website and also we have this youtube dialog window wherever you can just embed any sort of win uh, youtube video inside this alert box so you can embed this youtube video like this so these are the special alert dialogs that are available and now to get started in order to include this inside your javascript application you just need to make a html file and now in order to include this it is very easy either you can include this by cdn cdn stands for content delivery network this is the best approach so if you go to my blog post you just need to copy this code here the installation part you can see we are including this by cdn so we need not have to install the library so we can uh, just include the cdn version and just include this inside our html file now we can create a body element just to render out we can say body and inside our script section we will put a script here so now to initialize this library it is pretty simple if you drag down you will see a example here in order to have a simple alert box you will use alertify dot alert method so basically there is a alert method and here you will pass the string and simply if i want to run this i can open this with live server this is a visual studio code extension and you will see your extend uh, your alert window which is a good a basic window which comes in alertify js you can see if i click okay like this and now after this you can customize this also at button click when you click a button certain button then all then only this alert box appears and similarly we have this uh, uh you can see this is a success dialog box if you want a success dialog box you can just copy paste it so you can see it takes three arguments first is the title second is the message and third is the callback function which is alertify dot success so when you click this alert box this callback function will execute so if i just show you if i click okay here then now you can see this toast notification appears that you have clicked okay so this is a alert success dialog and now if you drag down you will see various examples on my blog so that is why i was telling you can just you can go to my blog and just follow along with this video so if i just paste it you will see this is a confirm window so basically 
if you want to confirm anything inside your application this is a confirm message if i click ok then it will say ok was clicked and if i click cancel you will see cancel was clicked so in this way guys it supports also i think a prompt dialog as well so if i just show you copy so basically this is a prompt window so here you need to have uh, any sort of you can take well input from the user so if i refresh this window you will see this will have a simple value here here you can enter any sort of value let's suppose i enter this value click on okay and now you can you, you entered this value you can see so this is very much useful when you are taking input from the user and then you can use this window in order to take the input so now if i move to the a next example we have this uh, toast notification that i already told you so you can even customize this if you want the notification after some time so you can give this set seconds value here you can see we are giving 5 seconds so you can customize this notification accordingly so if i open this inside my application you can see this notification appears sample and it stays it stays for the page 5 uh, seconds so the notification stays on the page for 5 seconds so you can just customize this notification change this value from 5 to 50 seconds accordingly and these are the different types of alert dialog boxes that it supports and also it can also support multi dialog as well so if i just show you guys uh you can see if i just <laughs> refresh this you can see there is also a anchor tag which is available inside the alert box if i click this anchor tag another window appears so we can move this and side by side you can see multiple dialog box are there if i again click this you can see so this is a linkable you can see so you can also do this also inside your application and uh, this is almost all this is available inside this uh, library alertify.js so do check out this library if you want to have beautiful alert boxes inside your application the link will be there inside the video description of my blog post here you can just download all the source code and do check my website guys freemediatools.com you will see the address on the video here which is present free media tools so this is my website where i provide free media tools to you anything related to photo video audio all these free tools are available for you for completely free so do check out this website and share this website with your friends and i will be seeing you in the next video until then thank you very much